Beast. That's going to be pretty sick. Oh, yeah, definitely. Beast, definitely a pretty good Pokemon trainer. Nick C, pro probably the person in this room who doesn't need any introduction. You know, so popular with Falcon. But right now, Beast, just calm jab, <laughs> jab rock combo to just start things off. So I think this is a pretty interesting matchup because, like, Falcon has always been a character who is exploitable, yeah. but he's also explosive, right? Yeah, just so, can rip your stock off. Exactly, you know, like and and he's because he's like such a fast character, that sort of trait gives him some good tools versus trainer. However, you know, trainer oh, is, is still yeah. a very like great like character yeah. to take advantage of Falcon of Absolutely. a character like Falcon. You just you got see Squirtle him. for the combos, right? Yeah. And he hasn't even switched off yet. He's he just been going pure Squirtle this whole entire he time. He doesn't need to because yeah, like no. he's a small, fast character. So yeah, like these are the type of yeah. characters that Falcon can struggle with the most. And now he's switching to the Ivysaur finally. Honestly, probably the character in this game who is the best at edge guarding Falcon. I know his up his down air got nerfed just a little bit. It's still the same size. Okay. It's just a little it's like it's weaker. So it's like it's not really gonna change any sort of game plans, okay. you know. Uh, also, the up B got weaker. Okay, so but uh, even then, yeah, it's still not going to change any game plans. Whoa. Wow! And like you see, for uh, example, like now you're seeing a little bit more of a slightly more even game. Very unfortunate. <gasps> no, yeah. because like because Falcon is such a fast character. When you're not Squirtle, like yeah. you're able to like overwhelm. Uh, you have the ability to overwhelm Ivysaur, you know? Like, Ivysaur needs to build up that wall and just, like, completely suppress and, you. you know, when he just isn't able to, you yeah. see Falcon just go, like, just completely get within his comfort zone. But, and, like, yep. But then you see him switch back to it because, like, you still need to seal out the kill. You still, yeah. like, have he's some good power. options. And, like, you know, he threw him off stage to try and, like, take that stage control. Uh, and, like, doing an all right job. Now he's, like, like a really hyper sense. So we're seeing the Charizard who awesome. got, like, <laughs> Ridiculously buffed. It was really funny. His Nair is actually OD now, and he made forward smash just stronger. Everything just Edge, better. Every, they're like, you know what? Oh, the the that's... killer guy needs to be stronger. Now, but yeah, that's... there's no. I don't believe that shield poke. I'm pretty sure he dropped shield because the shield was looking pretty healthy right there. Uh, let me take a look in the replay as yeah. uh, we take, as this goes on. But um, I think it. Just, I think it poked. Wow. But yeah. Let's make a charge right now. He's not going to let that deter him. Calmly fought back. I, I kind of feel like Nick is making this comeback right now because Beast is just like switching off of Squirtle. Yeah, no. Because like yeah, his Squirtle was, was putting him work. Yeah, he was doing so well as Squirtle. And like, I think he just needs to like uh, yeah, understand that. Hey, like, let me stick with what works right now. Yeah, sometimes people are like, oh, you know, to get caught up in Whoa. routine. You know, like, oh, he's at this percent. I need to switch. Instead of, like you said, doing what works. And Squirtle was working out well for him now on the verge of just losing the stock. Yeah. I mean, we did see an unfortunate uh, SD on the ledge on that That's second true. stock, you know. Um, but still, you know, uh, sticking with Squirtle probably would have been the wave. Yeah. But Nixie going to take game one. Yeah, good stuff for Nixie, obviously. You know, point out the SD, but, you know, he still had to fight pretty hard to make that come back. Yeah. You know, did really well in applying pressure to the Ivysaur, not allowing him to sub that wall. And when Charizard was out, Charizard didn't really get anything like going. It was just constant disadvantage. Nixie was like, oh, you're a heavy? Bet. You know, nothing but up airs, nares, strings for days. I'm mm -hmm. going to force you to switch off to Charizard and into a lighter, smaller character so I can get the KO while you're at a high percent. And it worked out really well for me. But right now, Beast, looking, you know, a little bit eh. But honestly, he doesn't really need, like, that first stock and a half was so phenomenal. Mm -hmm. You know, the jab locks, the confirms, the conversions, like, literally everything. So he, Nick got rid of FD and Smashville, yeah. but uh, Beast opting to just, like, run it back, which I really understand. Like, you could tell that he had, uh, like we said, a really good rhythm in the beginning. He kind of switched things up. So maybe, like, you know, it's like, let me keep the stage, and I'll just switch myself up, yeah. you know? It's not the stage, it's me. I just need to change up my game plan, you know, just a little bit. He's like, yo, I was schmixing that first stock, <laughs> so let me go back to the schmix. <laughs> yo, I was killing it. Yeah, and you like you see like he's doing. Oh, oh this God. is fantastic, oh, Jesus bro! Christ. Stay squirrel. Stay squirrel. Just stay squirrel. Like so, <laughs> I totally understand like the fear that like as he's like as uh, Nick will get some pot shots in, you know, it, uh, it, it gets scarier because Squirtle is so light. 
I think he's but like he's game and watch. He's not even line. getting to a high percent right now. He's already lapped them, actually. But like, even in that situation, like, even if you do trade a little bit, just stick with it because like you're like the the ratio of hits yeah, just, is like just so no. in your favor. Even like, if like you do end up dying because you were light, like you're still doing such win. a net positive. Exactly, and he's winning neutral a lot. Neutral for him definitely coming easier to mass squirrel than it would to Ivysaur. He's constantly winning these exchanges. I feel like. Uh, I feel like Beast may have like learned from it because like we're definitely seeing Squirtle yeah. now these like upper percents. Uh, he might switch now. Yep. Yeah, no, for recovery I totally get that. Great idea. Uh, actually, and Nick's already okay. kill person. Like this is actually looking. All right, trying to kill him on accident. I feel it. <laughs> oh, Ooh, saw that. That was totally. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the upper almost gonna get it. I thought we were going to see a up here. Oh, wow. All right, All right no. Just going to poke his shit with the up airs. Yeah, Nick not losing his cool. Totally just, like, uh, ready for anything that he's going to throw at him. He's being like, all right, you're going charge right, and I'm just going to, like, switch up my blink gameplay. I know how to approach this. Okay. And now, evening up the stocks here. Well, at 139. So I think this is going to be a real pivotal situation where uh, if Beast, like, fishes for the kill, th oh. that's where Nick will make his comeback. And yep, you kind of see that he's kind of doing it because he just now. wants to get that kill. Now he just wait. Oh, yes. okay. Great up yes. Great up because Nick was just waiting there. He almost knew that the change was coming, and he was fishing for that stomp to knee, but Beast not yeah. going to give it to him. Beast knew uh, that he was just going to stay on him. Uh, white on rice, man, and like he was like, okay, I'm gonna use my armor up B. We're on the, on the platform. I'm gonna take you up, you know. Oh, gentlemen! Right now, Nick has done a really Ooh. remarkable nice. job of actually bringing this back. Yeah, you I know. mean, he's still down a stock. Beast is like still in the driver's seat. He's still in control. Uh, like. I think he realized that he kind of overextended to try and like force that kill to happen, but like it worked out for Charizard uh, again that up B, and now he's still in that stock advantage and he's and still racking on a lot of percent. And right there, you saw Nick go back to spot. Yes, go, go yes, back. Yes, right? good. All right. Yeah, he's gonna switch. Throwing out a special so that he could uh, swap out right after, and flamethrower, you know, really good controls a lot of space. Okay. Right oh. This is risky. Oh, okay. Yep. Down throw. Red up. the DI. Yep. Just gonna Perfect. take it. And we saw Nick constantly trying to up B him, you know, as with Squirtle on Beast's second stock, but Beast just wasn't having any of it. You know, he didn't stick in, inside Shield, he wasn't scared, constantly fought back out with a move of some sort. Most of the time, when people play against Nick, they're so afraid of the hit confirms that they just stay in Shield. You know, they're, mm -hmm. they're literally shook in their Shield. But Beast, clearly not like that, and it worked out great for him. Yeah, no, he definitely, like, really learned from, those fir from the first game and yeah. been like, okay, okay. I got a little bit overzealous with like switching out and like Squirtle was moving, Squirtle so let me just stick with him. And the first dog, the Squirtle was, oh my goodness. Although I do want to see some uh, adaptation from Nick in like teching those, uh, yeah, those jab, jab locks. locks. It's yeah. like I think he got jab locked like five times already, like so far. He got jab locked <laughs> yeah. a lot, yeah. yeah. And like two of them resulted in kills, so it's just like that's a spooky situation. All right, so going to Kalos. Um, interesting pick. I like this. I I feel like this is a good stage for trainer. Uh, this is also like you get the wall bonus for uh, Falcon. for Falcon and yeah. for Squirtle having a wall cling, so it gets to mix up some recovery. True. Uh, but Kalos is really like the best, or at least like the most preferred counter pick, mostly when it comes to you know, Falcon players. Just okay. For, just for, just for that, you know, that safety of the. You know, of the wall jump, be able to tech it to get spiked. Yeah, and right we're now. definitely oh, seeing a Nick. big change oh, here. Oh my wow. God! He Falcon actually kick. almost paid for that with his life, but he worked. It worked out. <laughs> Falcon kick all the way off, and then with like the re like the retreating nair. slash recovering nair. So clean. Second hit sends him out. All right. Sticking with the Charizard. Ooh, he's like, yo, you're at 70. Check out this stronger F smash. <laughs> I don't, it definitely wouldn't have killed, but it would have been hilarious. Whoa, just grabbed him right as he was coming off from the ledge. Oh, okay. Nice smash. Last match. Oh. Yeah, and right now. This is this is yeah. the hard part for like when you're Charizard and you're just like, you know, he he's like kind of a momentum of like the like the flow of the players and how well they're doing. Yeah. Where if you miss your rhythm in like being able to seal it out. 
if you then you have the option like you go do I stay Charizard and try and make something happen or do I swap out and like go back to neutral and you see that beast is kind of sticking to it yep, but it's kind of biting him in the butt right yeah, now he's taking so much damage because right now he's just like not being able to get a move in he's too he's a big boy and Falcon is oh, really quick this should kill. I don't yeah oh no, no yeah wow all that rage on him too. Good, great touch. Oh, yeah. see. oh what a reap! But at 155, is he gonna switch or he's gonna stay? It, like this is now. This is the, the uh, super scary situation. He's at 160, right? Yeah. 170 now. And it's like you can't go Squirtle. Right. He'll literally pop. Yeah. And then like even Ivysaur, like you, the character is not gonna be like super fast to get away from situations like that. And now we have like a, a full stock lead beast on his last stock. It's like he's gonna have to. He's gonna have to work really hard with Squirtle right now. He's gonna right have now. to have one of those like game one first stocks. We've seen yeah, from over the exactly. games like right now. And it's getting the all right, doing the classic combos, but you know only 50 damage. You know Falcon isn't the lightest, so he really needs to get like a high ratio of like hits in. And right now they're going even. This is exactly what the person with the stock lead wants. Exactly. And honestly, getting that stock lead like first was so huge for Nixie. Yeah. Ooh. Put down there on shield. Oh, yep. Just gonna up me that. Uh, this is not looking good, because like when the when your DPS character is the <laughs> lightest and like has, he's <laughs> at 110, <laughs> he's gonna pop like a balloon, bro. It's like we okay. Oh. Ooh. Oh wow, great switch. Okay, dodge with the switch. But I, I yeah. really don't like Charizard right now for this matchup oh, at the very yep. least. Oh, gonna up me that. Yeah, it's gonna be a wrap. It is. And good stuff from Beast, but you know, rare stuff from Nixie really did well. And honestly, like like we said, he had to work on not getting blown up by the Squirtle. Yeah, and he definitely did.